I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I am just heading out to go um, do chores. And oh, we're starting to get some really nice weather out right now. So as you can tell, I'm in a t-shirt. That hasn't uh, happened for a while now. So it's pretty nice to have some some nice weather going on and um, so yeah I'm just gonna head out and do chores I do have a calf that I gotta go rescue um, we do have this big heaping it used to be a cow feeder but I don't know we got to get it out of the pasture so uh, if you remember the bull with his head stuck in the fence like I said, we'll always have some certain kind of special on the farm, so we'll go see if we can't get this little fella unstuck. Maybe he'll figure it out before I get out there. I really don't feel like crawling through the fence, but we'll get there. Buddy, out of all the places to get stuck, this probably wasn't the best one. Oh, you really are stuck. Hey, 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 easy. Brock, get out of here. Well, I didn't realize that you were stuck like that. Unfortunately, my husband isn't going to be home for a little bit. jump through the little hoop. Come on. Go the side there, bud. There you go. Nice big calf. I know, as you can tell, I'm in proper farming attire, but I want to be comfortable. There's nothing wrong with being comfortable. My plan was just to come out and feed cows until I Notice that little fella stuck in the feed bunk, but sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do, even if it is in leggings. Fired right up. Love my case. I'm gonna let this warm up for a little bit. Still got the feed mixer hooked up. We're getting down there on our. Uh, we got corn silage on this side, notes on that side. So we're getting down on our feed. We did put the heifers out on pasture today. Um, they had just finished up their bale in the yard and we're starting to get some decent grass. So um, I let them out by the driveway and um, get them on some grass, just get them out of the yard. The yard's a little muddy still. We've gotten quite a bit of rain the last few weeks. So trying to get them on some grass, save on some of the excess hay that we have left over. Um, yeah, but we'll go out and feed some cows. Ah, the office chair. Favorite little calf of the year is coming up. She's right here. 
She's got this perfect little circle on her head. It looks like a little halo. She's pretty cute. All the girls are all lined up. I think there might be a new freshie up on top of the hill right up there. So we're gonna go drive around and check it out. Little 24 who was just stuck in the feeder made it back out with his mom. Excuse me kids. Good old fashioned calf races up the hill. I think we are up to around 55 calves right now. So we got about another 30, 35 to go. Well, it looks like there's a fresh one up here. Jim's favorite color. I know how much he loves his black and white face. Now we bought some cows um, this fall that could possibly be bred to uh, Hartford. So we have a few more white faces in the group than usual. But it does in fact look like we had a brand new baby. I guess the thing's huge. So, lots of babies. Things are going good. We have a few more weeks left to feed. Um, once feed's uh, gone, we'll probably ship everybody out to pastures. And yeah, it's been it's been a really really nice day today. So, getting some stuff done. I'll probably go check out on check the heifers here in a little bit just to make sure that nobody ran through a fence. Everybody knows how lovely heifers can be, but um, yeah, we got those guys turned out to pasture today and everybody else here is happy. So yeah, we'll go check on the heifers here in a little bit. Just gonna run down the driveway quick and go check on our heifers that I turned out today. Um, most of them are replacements. A couple of them are some orphan calves that we kept back. They were just small and didn't quite make the uh, trailer. Just as a tent. So uh, let's see how they're doing. Fantastic day, and uh, if you like what you see, please like and subscribe. 